Hi guys, Snake Daddy here. Welcome back to Snake's new adventure. We are 25 episodes in, a quarter of a century old, or as I like to refer to it, four episodes more than I am in years. And if you believe that, you believe anything. Guys, behind me is Snowball the Snowman. We had lots of cool suggestions. Um, thank you very much if you gave me a suggestion in the video or in the comment section on you on the um, the poll community section on YouTube. I put a post there and also on Instagram as well. Um, I only pick people from the comments on the videos though. So just bear that in mind if you are going to comment in the future. I know some of you haven't got accounts, but I want to make it fair for people that actually have the accounts and can subscribe to me um, and do it that way. But I have picked Snowball the Snowman as the name. And if you have, if you did choose Snowball as one of the possible names for my for my snowman, get ready because I'm about to reveal if it was you whose name is now in the room of recognition. Let's have a look. Let's see if it's you. It is Mary Beth. Thank you very much for the suggestion. It's a really cool name. There was lots of Frosties, lots of people for Frosty. I love Frosty the Snowman. A, it's a, a traditional Frosty the Snowman is a very traditional snowman name, but as there were so many of you that chose it, I couldn't just pick one of you, so I thought I couldn't run I could put all of you on here. Um, so I thought I'll choose someone that chose Snowball. Snowball's a cool name. Um, yeah, so there you go, Mary Beth, well done to you. But I've also picked someone called Kane Dryson, who um, had a really cool idea, a good suggestion for, for dyes. Um, I know Lily, um, Lilia Terry Ann suggested that um, that we had um, we use these rose bushes to get dye because if you break these, that I can I can actually get red dye from those as well. And there are quite a few of them around, so I could get some more red dye while we're here. I'm not too fussed about replanting because meh and all that. I could, but I could replant one, I suppose, couldn't I? Like, I could, I could replant, I could replant that and then get two more. Doesn't really work. Then they grow tall, don't they? Even that. But we could do that. But um, they suggested using the botanica flowers because there's a lot more botanica flowers out there. Here comes the dog with his bone. I'll stick that in there. Use the, but using botanica flowers. If I use in botanica, look, if I type in botanica, look, we got these ones here. Let's just take one of these out as an example. So I'll take I'll take two out. So these you can't you can't just put these into your inventory. Or you can actually. You can do that with that, um, and it gives you the petals, but it doesn't give you dye. And the same with the same with this one as well. It doesn't even do anything. I'm not sure if that one will work. But if you make a pestle and mortar, let's have a look at this. If you make a pestle and mortar, which I think we can do. If I just um, get that, get that, get that, get a bowl, and then get that and get that and make a pestle and mortar, um, we can actually, I think, put, I don't think it works like that. It doesn't work like that, does it? You need to get the dye first, the uh, the petal first, then you smash it up and you get powder. Um, and the same, does it work with that one? It doesn't work with that one. Okay, right, that's fine. That's a mushroom, I guess that's why. Can you cook it if it's a mushroom? Can you cook it? No, you can't cook it. All right, well, the mushrooms doesn't like you can do as much with unless you can do some kind of usage. Oh, you can use two of them to make mushroom stew. Okay, so that's actually a bit better. Um, if you hover over anything in, in the um, Not Enough Items and press U, it gives you the uses, uses of them. So, for example, I can use this stuff to make clay or make stained glass. So it's, it's just the same as using any kind of dye. So it's actually quite a handy thing. So that's a really good thing. So if we get any um, any cool flowers now, I'm going to keep that in my inventory for now. Um, we can actually make um, we can make dyes and we can do stuff with them, which is quite a cool thing. Um, before we go and add more decoration to our room, I still want to get my kitchen cupboards up this on this wall here. Before we do that, oh, I did add a load more dyes. We've got 500. Uh, 590 green and 644 blue. We've got loads of that now. I went out and did a lot more dyes. I have rearranged the the uh, the recycler. You know the the ender chest was here. What I've done is I've repiped it all in here, um, and you can see I can got it all in there now. And I put the ender chest here. How are we getting this stuff out of it as well? That's weird. But as you can see, it's all going up, and that's because we have a full stack of 64 um, bits of scraps. If I go down and make. Um, these now I can make I can make seven scrap boxes. Um, I'll put them away for now. There we go, and we can actually go and get see what we get out of these scrap boxes. Well, we've got some decent stuff actually. We've got a bone, some nether rack, a couple of dirt, a single use battery, and a cooked chicken. I oh, want a cake, a cake as well. Very nice. Okay, so some of this stuff we can just stick straight back into the recycler. But I can't because there's, there's cobblestone in it. I'll just stick it in here. No, missed, missed. Stick it in there, boom, and we'll stick the chicken away. Uh, I suppose I could eat that in theory, couldn't I? Because I haven't actually 
uh, killed the chicken myself. It was made from scrap. I suppose that's something we could do. I'll leave the cake there and we can nom on that if we get hungry when we come back in. Um, so yeah, there we go, guys. That is, that's is—that's what we've made so far. That's the bits and bits of progress we've done. Um, but I think we should make this Christmas tree before we start making cupboards and things. I think we should make the Christmas tree. So where was Holiday? There. There's the Christmas tree. Let's take it. It's going to be massive, isn't it? I bet it's massive. Oh, it is quite big. Okay, let's go outside for this then. Let's go outside and let's plant this Christmas tree outside the base. Somewhere, somewhere nice. Let's, let's, tell you what, let's get rid of this rubber tree. So I don't think we've got any real need for rubber trees. Oh, hang on. I wonder if it will go inside the, um, the, the room. The room of recognition. No, it's too big. Oh, what I have done, guys, I have changed the roof in here. I've made it like a peaked roof. Took the same amount of slabs. Um, obviously, but I've, I've made the peak roof. I think that's, that's a better use of the roof. Um, where can we put this then? It's going to be cool. I think we should just put it here, look. At the bottom, where this, uh, where this, uh, where this rubber tree is. Let's just break all this. We should go from the top, shouldn't we, breaking the trees? It'd make life a lot easier. Get rid of all these. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Just smash all these leaves away so we can plant it. Boom, boom. Come on. There we go. Right, we've got some trees, got some sapling. Let's plant our Christmas tree right, uh, right there. Boom. There you go, look. It's Christmas. How cool is that? I think we need some presents for under our tree here, don't you? I think that'd be quite cool. Sorry for the sniffles. I'm still a bit meh. But I'm getting there. I'm getting a lot better. I'm feeling better. Just full of lurk. Still full of snot in a polite way full of snot still um right let's get a couple of the let's get some of them made and some of them made we'll put them under the tread if there's any other Christmassy things what else can we make can we make a, a gingerbread house uh no candy cane jar no what else can we make we can make a reindeer let's make a reindeer put that outside uh I think, oh, a nativity scene. That might be quite nice. We'll make a nativity scene outside. Um, and then we can make a fireplace and we'll hang some stockings up. Let's make some stockings and we'll, we'll, we'll hang them if we can. I know we probably can't hang them, hang them. Um, but there you go. Right, let's do that. Let's just get the let's get the presents and that put outside the tree. And our reindeer. Get a nice little Christmas scene going on outside here. So we'll have uh, we'll have you. Where can I put you? I'll put you. Do I, hear a, do I hear a skeleton coming? I'm not sure. Right, we'll put you. Why can't I go nearer? I want to go nearer to the... Put some there. There we go. And we'll put some... Mm, there. There we go. And then we'll put the reindeer can go... Oh, reindeer. Why are you being so... Why are you got to be so cruel? Right, we'll put you there. There we go. And what else we got? We've got a nativity scene. We'll put that down as well. How big's that? Not too big. That's okay then. Right, let's put that somewhere here if we can. Can we put it like here? Next to the... No, we can't. Okay. Um, where can we put you that's going to work? Why are you... What? Oh, all right, we'll have to put the nativity scene this side. There you go. So we've got a little... Oh, look at that thing. That's pretty swish, isn't it? Look at the detail in there. Proper Minecraft characters, proper Minecraft animals and stuff. That's really cool. Got some presents. It's looking cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Right, we've got a very festive see uh, little scenario there. Got some rubber sap as well there. So we'll stick this all back in here. Uh, stick you in there, you in there, there you go. Right, we've got our we've got our, our stockings to hang up. We need to get some kind of fireplace now, don't we? Have we got is there a fireplace in here that we could actually make? Because if there is, that would be quite nice. Let's see if we can make a fireplace. Uh fire. There's a fire fireplace. Should we make that? This probably isn't what we need at all, but um We probably should move our friend. We could put it there, oh it won't work, will it there? I won't work there, no. Um, uh, fireplace in there, maybe. Oh, look, it burns as well. It gives you... Then we can put our stockings above it. There you go. Look, that's Christmassy. We'll get one more Christmassy thing to put next to it. Let's put... Um, let's let's quickly go to the uh, holiday thing again. Let's find something we could put next to it. Uh, Christmas bells, no. A gingerbread house, possibly. Uh... Mistletoe. We could put some mistletoe above the door. Uh, right, that, that's... Oh, we've got loads of things, actually. Um, what can we make? These are the Alta de Muertos. That's very, that's very, um, we'll put a candy bowl down just next to the, next to the fireplace. If anyone comes along and they want to take some candy, they can. There you go. We'll have one more, we'll have one more stocking just because we can. 
Uh, one more stock in. Let's have a look. Where is there was a third one, wasn't there? Stock in one, stock in two. Was there another th stock in I saw? I'm sure, I saw another one. Stock oh, there's a different one. There. Hang on, this one's got this one's got presents in. Hang on, let's grab you. How much have we got left? We've got we've still got quite a bit left. It's good. There you go. Look, that's not quite as nice, but there you go. We've got three stockings hanging above our fire, ready for Christmas. It's looking really nice. Snowball the snowman can have a look over the fire. I like it a lot. Right, let's look at getting some kitchen cupboards. Let's have a look. Let's take off these um, kitchen. There you go. Right, we need bottom cabinets. We need some bottom cabinets. We need one of them. We need another one of them. And we need one of them. So let's just see how much this makes. That can go there. There you go. And then we could put... Well, eventually they'll go there, won't they, actually? Probably should have moved that. That probably would have been a better idea somewhere else. But that's okay for now. I'll use those um, in the future. Can I just put them on the wall? Maybe we should put them... Hmm. Maybe we should move the fireplace. No, do you know what? No, I'm going to leave that there. I'll keep them for now. We'll put them back in our thing. And then after Christmas, we can we can replace these with um, with with the... Uh... Actually, no, because that... Yeah, we can put them on that side then, can't we? Right, let's get... Let's get uh, a kitchen. Right, we need some wall cupboards. So we need... Um, top cabinet glass. We'll have one of them. Are these all just bottom cabinets? Yeah. Okay. So we'll have we'll have a top cabinet and glass. We'll have a we'll have a top cabinet. Is there any others? We'll have two of them. There we go. Right. So we're going to put one there. We'll put one there, and I'll we'll put the the there you go in between. Looking fancy. We're going to get a microwave. I saw a microwave. We need to get a microwave and put it on top of that cabinet there. That would be really cool. See, we're making we're making progress. We're making our we're almost making this like a little one bedroom flat, aren't we? That's what that's kind of what we're doing here. That's kind of what we've got going on here. Um, well, they've got loads of things, haven't they? Look at this. Built in microwave, dark. Built in microwave, oven wall. Right, we'll have a microwave. That will do. And we'll stick the mic. Oh, the microwave has to go on the wall. Oh, okay. Um, we can put that there. I guess that will work. So we've got a little bit of worktop, but I'd rather have a work to, um, microwave we can put on top of there. But that's okay. We've got a little kitchen area. I will rejig this again after Christmas. We can rejig um, once we've got rid of the fireplace. We can move stuff around. Get rid of get rid of snowball the snowman. Put some stuff on this side. It's looking good. I'd like some kind of shelving. Do they do shelving? Sh I do shelves. Okay, really cool. Right. Um, let's grab. Let's grab. Let's grab some of these. One. Two, three. Let's just see how that what that looks like for now. There you go. That's not going to work there though, is it? No, because we've got R two there. We could put it up higher, but I think it's got to be going lower, isn't it? It's really got to be lower there. And then, is that because of that, or is that because of him? Let's move R two for a second. Yeah, it is okay. So we can, can we put R two on the shelf? <gasps> we can. Okay, this is cool. Right, let's put R two on this shelf then. There you go, Artu's on the shelf now. That's really cool. I like it. Right, we need some more of these then. So let's get let's get rid of these lights and we'll make some more shelving. Um oh, I didn't need to move the shelves actually. Oh no, it's because of them, isn't it? It's because of them. Well let's just, let's get some more shelves. We can move all those. So shelf. Shell. Right, we need one, two, three. There we go. Right, let's move them there. And let's put the shelves. Right, so they've got to be broken. We need to put them, move them for now. There we go. Come here, right? So shelf, shelf, shelf. Um, if Shemmy can't put them on top, isn't it? Really, that would have been cool. Um, let's just go up on the shelf. Hang on. So we need to, we need to hover. Hang on, we need to hover. What's hover? It's one of these. There you go. We'll hover. There we go. Let's like, give a light as well. Santa plushie, da, 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 under the tree for me. And then we could maybe put, let's take the hover off now, there we go. Can we put the torches there? Can we put them there? No, we can't. Put them above, yes we can. Right, we're going to put one torch either end now. There we go. Break you, perfect. Right, we need, we need, we need two more things for this, for this end here. What can we make this little, little kind of thing? A creeper, yes, we'll have a little stuffed creeper. Um, and what else can we get? What can we get? A little toy maybe, a little... Jack in a box would be quite cool. Let's get a jack in a box. There you go. Look, so we've got a creeper. Um, let's put you on there. Creeper and the 
Jack in the box. It's too big. Okay, that's that's fine. In that case, then let's put the let's see if we can put the creeper here, the Jack in the box there maybe, and the creeper here. Will that work? Yes, it will. Perfect. There you go. So we've got a creeper. Doesn't really look like a creeper. An R2D2, a Jack in the box, which is actually facing the wrong way. So let's sort him out because that's no good. Let's just hover. Uh, we need to turn you round like so. Boom. That's a terrifying Jack in the box, but we have one nonetheless. Let's let's get back to our normal. So there you go. We've got we've got some cool little. We've got Christmassy section down here. We've got our Christmas fireplace. We've got a nice little kitchen area with shelves on here. Microwave on the wall. This is looking rather swish, if I do say so myself. I'm really liking this. This is really, really good. I need a sip of drink because I'm really, really thirsty. Ah, mint tea, refreshing. Right, there you go. Hello. Um, little zomble down there. You see him? Little zomb. Oh, no, that's not the right button for it. There you go. Hello. Hello there. Get out of the room of recognition. You're not allowed in there. Good. Right. Um, I think the other thing I'd like to do is get that start getting that wall down for the room of recognition. Um, carpet. We need to make carpet, don't we? So have we? How much wool have we got first? Because you need to make carpet. Obviously, you need. Oh, you can chisel wool. Fancy. Okay, hang on then. Right. So to make carpet, you need wool. To make wool, we need wool. So we haven't got any. So let's make some wool. Can we make wool? How much wool can we make? Uh, wool. Boom. Six pieces of wool. How much cotton have we got? We got we got oh we got a load of cotton okay hang on then uh, how do you make it two cotton crop how do we make string again from cotton I've forgotten I've forgotten how to make string from cotton forgotten um, string how do we make string again I should know this I did this in the last episode didn't I string uh, what cotton I oh, mean three 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 strings Nate three string there you go right two of them. Then we can make some more, put that away. We can make some more uh, wool from you. There we go. Boom, we've got seven bits of wool. That's, oh, didn't want you. we do want you actually, because we'll need to make the thing right. We need some orange dye, we should make some red dye. What have we got? What dye have we got? We've got, we got dye, we've got red dye, and we've got 21 red dye. So we'll do that, we'll put that in the middle, and then we can go, oh, I haven't got enough wool to go around the outside. Oh, that's annoying, oh, hang on then, right. We need to get, we need to get one more bit of wool. Um, we need to get some string. Have we got more cotton? Oh, we have. We have, we have, we have. Perfect. Three. So we need we need one piece. We need one piece. Um, cotton. Uh, cotton. Let's grab you out quickly. Boom, boom, boom. There you go. String. And then... Uh, uh, and you're going to click on Ruh. The dog is right under my feet being a pain. Bless him. Right, there we go. One more bit of wool. Perfect. We have enough. Uh, wool. What are you doing, Max? Oh, I actually had nine already. Oh, I had enough. What am I talking about? What? Oh, does that not work on this? Does this not work like that? How do you dye wool? Do you have to do one at a time? Well, that's annoying if you do, isn't it? That's that's very annoying. Yeah, you do. Okay. I thought you could. I thought you could do that with one piece and it would work. But no, right? We've got we've got enough. We've got six. There you go. Ten of them. Ten pieces of wool. I can make some red. Not like that. Red carpet. Max, what are you doing? There we go. We've got fifteen pieces of carpet. Can I you now chisel the carpet? If I can, that would be fan dabby tastic. Probably should have done a pattern really. Red wool. Um. Let's just take that. Let's just use this for now. Let's just use this for now. We can always change it at another time. Look at the Christmas, it looks good, it's Christmassy. Um, okay, oh, zombie's coming back. Hello, you've been hiding around there, have you? You've been hiding around there. Silly man. Right, um, let's, let's, we've got, only got 15 though, so we need to make more. So if we go one, oh, we need to get the glowstone first. What am I talking about? We need to get glowstone so we can make the room light up. That was what Terry Ann suggested, and I need to do it in full, completely, without, without changing anything. Glowstone, how much glowstone have we got? 18. Can I make glowstone blocks like that? No, it's four, isn't it? I remember. Come on, you know that. You know that better than than anyone else. There you go. Uh, boom. And then boom, boom. There you go. Perfect. Right, we've got only got four pieces, but it's enough to light up probably an area on the floor, isn't it? <sighs> well done. Well done, you. Glowstone. Right, try that again without putting glowstone down this time. Shut the door. Right, let's go. Hello. Um, right, 
glowstone. I need to make it in a pattern that's going to light up the floor the best. If we just go maybe one there and one there or something, maybe one there and one there, that would be better. And then glowstone the floor there, glowstone the floor there, and then one uh, there, one there. There we go. Oh, I'm sunk to the bottom. Right, there we go. Oh, and again. Now I can put carpet over these ones, and that will still light up the area just the same. So if I take these out of here, is this going to be too dark now, I wonder? We'll find out. We'll find out what happens. I think this glowstone should, should light it up okay. So now we need to make a pattern out of the rest. If I go, if I go like there and there and there. So if we go, if we go on the outside there and the outside there, that's kind of a, kind of a pattern. We've only got three pieces left. How can we, so we need to let, basically get more carpet to, so we can make a pattern out of that. That's what we need to do. Okay. That's our plan. So we're going to go, I'll put one there, and one there, and one there, and then we need one more to go there. Then maybe we could fill it up with just, say, white, um, just maybe like a plain white carpet or something. Maybe that would, sort of thing would work. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. So we need to get a lot more cotton, a lot more string, kill more, kill more spiders and stuff. That would work. So we've got there. We could replant, I guess, and run out like a, a row of it down here. Couldn't we really? I mean, we, we do have... We do have, uh, how do I make, can I just replant the cotton? No, how do you make cotton seeds then? Oh, I've got some cotton seeds. Maybe I have cotton seeds. You need to smash the plant for that. Cotton, oh, we have seven. Result, okay. Result. Um, right, let's put the bedroom things away. Put that away. Put the chisel away for now. Put that saw, we don't need it, but I'll put that away. Could have scrapped that, really. Could have scrapped that. I think we've got enough scrap, actually, again. I think that's filled up. Um, I think that has filled up. So we're going to go all the way down here. I'm going to break that one now because we don't need it. And I'll replant. There we go. I'll replant the, the seeds for that there. Get you replanted. There's no point in wasting it. We might as well keep more wheat growing. You never know we're going to need it. We should go to a village and see if we can trade it with a with a villager somehow. Get some get some new stuff. Right, there we go. Can I bone mill this cotton and make, me, make that one more piece of carpet? Because that's going to it's gonna annoy me if we can't. Um, let's put you away for now. Uh, bones, yes, we can. Let's just let's just make you all into just make you all into bone mill. There we go. I've got a million pieces of bone mill now. There we go. So let's bone mill all of this. Come on, run, fly, fly. There we go. Look, boom, 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 boom. Perfect. Okay, right. Let's bone mill you. Look at this. Look, this is this is this is the way you bone mill. This is this is magical. This is magical bone milling. You literally just right click on bone mill all the time. It's gonna just keep going over it and over it and over it. I don't think I've ever really oh I just bone milled the ground. I don't want that. No, I don't don't want that there, thanks. I don't want that. Um I, I've never really used cotton before, but this is a really good I'm just gonna use all of it so we've got tons of it, then we're never gonna run out. Maybe I could properly carpet the whole floor then. There we go, look. Let's just get that done before we go today. Uh don't wanna no, don't want you to be there we go, we've got it, we've got it all. Boom, boom, boom. There we go, perfect. Right, we've got loads of cotton now. Tons of the stuff. Tons of the stuff. So, 60 pieces of cotton. That's not how you do it. String. Oh, really? What are you doing? Come on. Try again. So that there is, that's how you do it. 19. There we got, we've got 38. We've got three. I don't know why I didn't make another one. There we go. 40. We turn that into wool, boom. We turn that into thing, and that's not how you do it. We turn that into thing. 15 more pieces. We get the chisel out again. Now, do I, I need one more piece of red dye. So we need red, red dye. There we go, one more piece there. And I, oh, I did that completely and utterly wrong, didn't I? Because I needed to have the white thingy. All right, we're going to see what we could do out of yellow. Let's have a look what we could do out of yellow then. What have we got out of yellow? We've only got one bit of yellow dye, unfortunately. Uh, and I can't dye the blooming carpet, can I already? Can I do that? Does that work? No, of course not. Can I dye carpet at all? Is there any way of dyeing carpet? Can you make dyed carpet with any other way of doing it at all? No, you can't. That's just really annoying. Oh, snaky. Oh, well, it looks like we're using white carpet then, doesn't it? It looks like we're using white carpet. Um, we can make a nice 
really gaudy pattern. Did I, make, I must have made more than seven. Hang on. Hang on. I had... What? I had loads. What are you talking about? What are you talking about, son? Uh, right. We had loads. Right. Let's grab you. Chisel. And you. And you. Oh, we've got 15. There we go. Right. Let's put you back. Put you back. If I need more, I can do... I can get more of that red one uh, later on. It's fine. We can do that. There'll be more There'll be more cotton probably in a second. More cotton in a second. Okay. Let's get the white ones down in a nice sort of pattern. Let's just let's literally just leave them. Oh, this is horrible, isn't it? This is really horrible. It truly is horrible. Okay. <laughs> right, we're going to go. We need one more to go over there, don't we? I'd like to do that before we finish, but I'm not going to be able to. So we're going to go there and there, and then we'll put you there. And it's a real garish. Look at that for a garish room. When it's done, though, it might look okay. I say might. It might not as well. I think probably we're better off using white. I reckon we're better off using white. Just plain, plain old boring white because that was so garish or something out of a 70s like mexican not mexican a uh, moroccan restaurant or something doesn't it let's quickly go and get uh just get the the thing re re chiseled so put my chisel away re chiseled place it down as white so it's just boring and plain on the floor um chisel right come here re chisel re chisel you boom uh what does that one look like what does that one look like Grey almost, isn't it? That might work actually. That might work. Right. Have we got any more cotton? Oh, any more cotton yet? Well, that's not going to help, is it? No, no more cotton yet. Okay, that's fine. We're not going to. We're, we're condemned not to have the final red one down just yet. Oh, it looks like a rug. It looks like a rug. I like that. I like that actually. Now we're going to go for white. Hang on. Now we just go for plain white now, right? The plain old white one. Like there and there. Like that. And that's what we're going to do. Okay, there we go then. That's going to be our finished carpet. Boring, horrible. But it's... We can change it from time to time. We can change it. We'll have the grey rug in the middle. We'll have white everywhere else. One bit of red that's got to go in that corner. Bob's your uncle. Fanny's your aunt. Guys, there you go. The horrible, garish thing is done. I'm going to say goodbye. Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed this episode, consider, uh, consider pressing the like button. And if you really enjoy the content, maybe you could press the subscribe button. If you do press the, press the subscribe button, I can't even speak, press the subscribe button. Then uh, hit the bell as well. You'll be notified whenever I upload a video, which is round about 4 o'clock at the weekdays and midday on Saturdays and Sundays. But anyway, hope you've enjoyed. If you have, I say press those buttons, and I will see you soon for another episode of Snake's New Adventure. Cheers, guys. Bye.